Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another session of Hogwarts Legacy. Thank you very much for joining me this fine evening. I hope you are doing well. Without further ado, let's get back into the game and see how our adventure continues. Oh, there we go. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the Headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. That was cool effect. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. <laughs> Not that bad. I was up to nothing, counterfeit. I wasn't doing anything bad. This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate Rebellion. yourself about wizarding lore. Ah, treasure chest. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. So there's something there, but it's not letting me reveal it yet. Revelio. Hmm. Oh, there's a bit of stutter. I might have to come back here and reveal it when I'm not having to follow Weasley around. Yeah, that's much better. There we go. Get rid of motion blur. Simply cast Revelio on it. And we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. There we go. House Elf Recipe Book Guide Pages. Rumoured to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's original creations. This book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favourite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes like pickled dirigible plums are likely an acquired taste. I don't know, I like uh, plums every now and again. So we've unlocked a f field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Okay. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points. Open the field guide. Wizarding level XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select challenges menu to continue. So collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select f field guide pages to continue. So if we collect two field guide pages we gain Hogwarts Regalia Spectacles. Yeah, 
Cool. So we've got uh, cosmetic unlocks. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Okay. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Right, well, I'm going to go back now, so if it'll let me. Because we saw another field guide page. Oh. Okay. So I'll have to go back and collect that later. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Ah, so it's a flame pot. So we can fast travel to the common room. That makes sense. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house, common rooms and the Great Hall. Select the Great Hall. In this view you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you've discovered, including your own house common room. Grey flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Okay. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, library and greenhouse. Library annex to continue. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames for you. Use A, D to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu flames. Okay. Off we go. So Revelio will clearly highlight enemies. Q to protect and holding Q will follow up with a stupefied counter attack. It temporarily stuns certain opponents and breaks shield charms. Ah. Oh, except on hard enemies. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Revelio. Go. What are you flu? up to now? Hmm, nosy sod. I'm wandering around. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. I'd like to open a shop in Hogsmeade for myself. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Hmm. What's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butter beer there with friends in due course. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Hecate, similar to Hecate. A goddess of witchcraft, I believe. 
What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Right, let's get going then. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Hmm. Do we try and trust Professor Weasley? Yeah, let, let's give it a go. Let's give it a go, I think. Yeah. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know where... Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Yeah, there's still a bit of still a bit of frame drop at first. Right, what does Figgy Boy want? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say... I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now. As capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. New quest. Open the map.
This represents main quest, completing main quest, will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Okay, so we've got 35 chests to collect, 150 field guide pages, 10 demi-guy statues, and one astronomy table. Hmm, okay. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases you will need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New, skill, new spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest rewards. So we can go to Defense Against the Dark Arts and get Levioso. Or we can go to Charms class and get Accio. Mm, let's go Defense Against the Dark Arts. Let's start there, shall we? The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Oh, so I'm not even using my own one yet. I'm using a, a borrowed one. And we got given another. Um, have we got given another page? Yeah, so that's our quest. So let's have a look at our challenges. Right, so no, we haven't got an, another field guide yet. And we've got... Complete two main story quests, and we get legendary gloves. Okay. Haroti ho, okie koki. Oh, and there's a side quest here by the look of it. This cannot possibly be as difficult as it seems. Oh god, is there... Hello, Lenora. What are you looking at? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Have you learned anything about it? Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Okay. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Uh, okay. So it's a it's like a statue near stairways with a twisted pillar. We got twisted pillars here. We're looking for a statue. It's not this side. Here. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? 
Lumos. Oh. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Ah, moth to a flame, or a moth to a light. Um, okay, I've got it, so how do I return it? Oh, I probably just need to do that. Ha. There we go. I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Oh. And there's our field guide page. Sorry about that. And there's our first challenge done. So let's go and claim our reward, shall we? Let's get the, the glasses. So if we get eight pages, we get Hogwarts Regalia Gloves. Okay. Cool. Did you get your wish room from Pippins, or did you pick yourself? Right, let's go and uh, tell Lenora then. And welcome to the stream for Alia. Thank you for joining this evening. And thank you any any lurkers that are hanging around as well. Thank you very much for, for coming along. So it looks like there's a puzzle there to be solved. So we'll, we might come back and look at that. Revelio. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. We've got some more flu flames. Um, well, I'll think about it. Let's carry on with. <laughs> Let's get to our first class, shall we? Hopefully, I've not gone. Oh, I have completely gone the wrong way. Oh. Treasure chest. Yeah, so the chest is locked behind that puzzle. Okay. Rebellion. Yeah, and there's a page here. Wyvern Fountain Guide Pages. This fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumours to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Cadogan, this is most assuredly not meant to be the wyvern of Y. Slain by the lively knight in spite of himself. <laughs> Yeah, so that puzzle room's got two chests in it, by the look of it. Revelio. So that's locked by level. Oh, it's a house elf. Wait, it was a house elf. Level one unlocked. Alright, we can't use that yet. Okay. There is flu flu flame. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. <laughs> That's good. I didn't realise the statue was talking to us. Yeah, Siamese. Let's stroke the cat. Yeah, friendly cat. Rebellion. And there's a treasure chest somewhere around here. Hmm. Oh, it's a magical pair of shears. <laughs> oh, there's another flu flame. 
There's nothing to say to us now. Revelio. Level two lock. More treasure chests. That young'un's now a teacher herself. It's a wonder she's not gobbled up by her own fanged geranium. <laughs> Lumos. If someone gets struck by Protego. a person in the room, we do have to That's a bit harsh. Why have they got an Iron Maiden? A bit grim. Now, isn't it? Crummy little faces. I'll just die. Okay, he's so got. He's in at the present moment, the headmaster. We'll be sure to tell him how very much you despise him. Might as well be surrounded by Jarvis. Okay. So that, he's just a, a talker. Spin the globe. What was that spell, potato? No, <laughs> no for alien. Not potato, it was protego, and it creates a shield around you. <laughs> okay, angry looking. Hey, a slap of you. Protego! Revelio. Right, so I can't do anything with that treasure chest yet. It would appear. Uh -huh. Skelly dog. Yeah, that wasn't creepy at all. Eh, ah, another moth picture. Lewis. Spell potato more. <laughs> yeah, fair play. Fair play. Right, so there should be a moth around here somewhere. Oh, treasure chest. We'll have that. And there's more Revelio. More chests around. There. And there's the moth. Lumos. Let's get it back to its painting. Oh, it's a punch passage, so it's stinky. That's another field manual. Doing well there. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. So that's locked. It's a centaur. Right, I reckon we're done here for now. Let's get to our first class, shall we? Although, there might still be stuff knocking around. Must loot goblin. Huh, interesting. So there's a flu flame somewhere nearby. What does T do? Ah, T gives us access to replot spells. Interesting. Okay, I'll have to remember that. There's the flame. Off on another adventure, are we? Maybe. Revelio. Is there anything else around? 
There's plenty of tea at least. Bit of live music. How are the frames looking guys? Are we still doing okay? Magical band. Yeah, come on, let's get on with lessons. Well, that's it for this evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining me for this uh, Hogwarts Legacy video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you'll come back and watch some more of this series as we go through it. Um, if you want to see this live, you can come and watch me on Twitch at Monkey Tree. Otherwise, it will be posted here um, in chunks, and I will be looking at generating some form of stream archive so if you'd rather have a long form video without the cuts in there i will be posting that to a new channel if you're happy watching this in smaller chunks shall we say um i hope you stick with the series i hope you stick with the character and i hope you stick with the channel once again thank you very much for watching and have a fantastic evening bye bye